Yeah, Joe Budden says NBA Youngboy fell off. His music is trash. Like, comment, subscribe. You like this guy. Shout out to Coolin TV. Let's see what's up with this. Let's see what's up. Uh, what else do I have written down here? Uh, you ready to tell the truth about NBA Youngboy? Uh, I'm not ready to do this. Uh, what's the truth? That nigga's trash. He's horrible. He is horrible. He is horrible. That's crazy. That's crazy. But the nigga been killing you. He's been in the hospital. He's making wild albums and shit like that. He making wild albums, but. Them shit's ain't been hidden. He put out a lot of work. I mean, I don't. Me, personally. I don't really. I listen to like a few songs, man. Yeah, but man. him saying like he tries. Like, nah, that's, that's crazy. Too crazy. Yeah, nah. that was crazy. Nah, that's crazy. And it's crazy. And it's crazy because it's crazy because Joe Budden is nah. That's not even why it's crazy. The only reason why it's crazy because nigga, yeah, we said a young boy don't care. Yeah. But Joe Budden is like the number one podcaster right now. So in the U.S., yeah, they, he See, was the number one on that on that list they made. He was yeah. number one. So his uh, voice, yeah, his voice, yeah. yeah, his voice is important. Like so. When he say shit like this, you, you have, have to, to run off and you gotta, gotta say something, some yeah, you gotta respond. For a fact, you gotta get on some bullshit like Nah, yeah, like, I'm not gonna lie, young I'm boy. Right now, right now. Pause. Come on, take it easy, man. Come on, man. Take a shot, too. Come on, wow. Niggas, 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 scamming, niggas, niggas, scamming, niggas, 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 I don't know nothing about that. I don't care about that. I'm here about this topic. You feel me? But yeah, he, um, yeah, he bugging though, saying, like, he, he, I'm not gonna lie. I kind of agree. His music. I listen to Young Boy. I told y'all, y'all niggas. If y'all been watching, y'all know mm-hmm. I fuck with Young Boy. You know if I play yeah. him all the time in the week. Nice. You know I rock with him. That's but true. I haven't been rocking with him like that since yeah. Rilla. Since since Rilla too. Hold on, hold on. I didn't just drop the song though. I ain't like it. Nah, my, new my, song wasn't on a lot. Yeah, my perspective. It wasn't all that to me. Sure, right? He dropped the future. The I like the other shit he just dropped though. Uh, uh, yeah. uh, fuck me yeah. some. Yeah, yeah. that ain't yeah. straight. That's my yeah. shit. Yeah, that's fire. Yeah, I go lie. He, he 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 been missing lately. But you can't shit on a nigga because he on house arrest. Like he's yeah, stuck he, in the crib. He, he don't know what to do. He can't do nothing. He's just sitting in the crib all day long. He's, he going <laughs> he, he go off his own vibe. Yeah, me? like he can't really. Like, I can't put him. Yeah, I can't. Do that, he, yeah, he, like to he, say he, he trash he, is crazy. You gotta be like, yo, I don't fuck with it. He can't go to the studio. And it, yeah, he got his crib. He's sitting in his crib he's not fuck all with him. day long. And he's not, not fuck with him. So it just look like it's a plot. He fuck with a lot of niggas too. He is really, 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 really bad. As a rapper or a person? I don't know him as a person. Oh, okay. I'm only speaking about... He should have, like, he's going too crazy with the... Yeah, he's taking no, first. Nah, he's going to be trash. Yeah, that's crazy. He's real, 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 real bad. He's nah, like, that's crazy. Nah, that's, that's crazy. crazy. He's wild. Yeah, nigga, I'm saying, like, like I've been saying I don't like his music. last few albums. That's what I've been saying. I don't fuck with his... No, no, we talking about... What are you talking about? That's what he said. As a person, as But he said no. He just said no. Why are you going over that? I think it's a hater. I, I, can't, you can't, I mean, about? it's crazy that he just he going mad like this. But Word. but everybody got their own opinion. Yeah. But you can't you can't call a nigga sh- like yeah, it's just trash. Making music for your age category. Yeah, exactly. Bro. Papa, you twenty five years older. Yeah, but this nigga listen to all music. But still, pop, pop, his pop, music pop, pop, is not. Up. He's making music for his fans. <laughs> Yeah. That's it. That's what his fans want. Exactly. Nah, that's not what they want. Cause he fake for all of them. He not lying. He just he just they gotta say like he trash. Like and the way he doing real, it, he's going. Bad, bad, bad. Yeah, like oh, that's bad. crazy. That's crazy. Yeah, that's crazy. Cause oh. I ain't gonna lie, young boy got a million more plaques than him. Word. A million more Word. plaques than him. Any any Lazarus. So I mean, that's just he's really 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 bad. And that thing happened with him where. When he was out, the label pushed a button and did some YouTube shit. So then all the little kids had to just come to the fucking, come to the gathering and tell you about NBA young boy views and how great he is and how awesome he is and how amazing he's doing. Now that the label's backed up a bit, and now that we done had about three or four projects while he's been in Utah on house arrest. He had way more than that. I know. And that's that, that, I know. that to me, is where the I problem know. lies. Because... Earlier young boy music don't sound like this to me. Like even he just dropped a single today. I listened to it last night and I cut it off midway through. I'm just like I can't. What's the difference between his music then and now? And I'm gonna keep it a hundred. 
I be watching this shit sometime. I respect his music taste, like his point of view on music, because mm-hmm. he don't hold back on niggas. He don't hold back, like, yeah, he, he listen to everything. He a music head, like, I feel like he a mm-hmm. music head like me. That nigga be, you know, he said the same shit I said about ESTG. I was feeling like these niggas was watching me at a point in time. And I was like, yo, you <laughs> said the same shit I said, <laughs> Real talk. That nigga's in my mind. That's like, yo, bro, that nigga said the same shit I said about ESTG. That's, it. That's that gas. <laughs> it off midway through. I'm it's just like, I can't. What's the difference between his music then and now? The shit, me, I could hear it. Like, I literally, I can hear it. Utah. Can, What's up, everybody? It's your boy, Nashville, and welcome to Cool and TV. Now, Joe Budden straight up saying, hey, man, NBA young boy music is fucking ass, all right? It's horrible, man. horrible, it's bad, bad, all right? He said it multiple times, y'all heard him. So, you know, keep in mind, Joe Budden don't know NBA young boy. You know, he don't know him personally. That's why he said, you know, in this clip that it's nothing personal, all right? I don't know the young man, blah, blah, blah. But the music, it ain't hitting, all right? It ain't hitting. It seems like, you know, young boy been in a crazy mental state. Not, I wouldn't say crazy, but he been in a, you know, a different mental state while he been on house arrest for almost two years. You know, he haven't stepped foot outside of Utah. He always around his house. So he going through a little mental thing, man, right now. And it shows in his music, all right? Go back and listen to old NBA young boy albums. Go listen to the albums that he dropped while he in Utah, all right? They hit different. You know, very different. Songs he be making now, it's like a lot of depressed music. Now he still got some damn, some shit that slap in these albums. I ain't even gonna cap, all right? He got some shit that slap, but a lot of his music ain't hitting like the same. And I, I feel like anybody can say that now. Now when you go down on- You can't, <coughs> if his music's on some depression, the nigga is sitting in his crib on house or Oh, shit ain't depressed, but he do have his little moments, but... If he, I'm not trying to say, if he got some depressed music... You know what you it can't be, can't blame him. Nigga, he's sitting in the crib all day doing nothing. He's different to everybody, fam. Yeah. He <laughs> everybody different. He does this, like, literally, does the same shit every day. Go outside, go inside. Get fresh. Go outside, get fresh, get fresh, fresh and front. sit That's in the crib. Going on. Just take pictures. That's depressing. If you really... If you not... If you want... Well, for the people that's out there... When well, no, I'm not talking to the camera, I'm talking to everybody out there... If you ever been on house arrest, you should know like how that shit feels. And he been on that shit like three years. Now. Exactly, three years. he can't do nothing. So but like, just you gotta, sit there. yeah, you gotta like, cut him some slack. Exactly, you, you, you just gotta cut him some slack. Like you gotta he ain't cut doing some nothing. Slack. He's just trying to compete. He could have been not giving the music to none of us. Exactly. He could have been just sitting there just chilling. At least he giving you feel me. At least he throwing music out. And there that's why he giving niggas so much music because he ain't got nothing else to do. Exactly, so but he just niggas he just going crazy. I respect it. It just. You gotta you gotta take the criticism when it comes mm-hmm. with it because you you put out a lot of shit it's so fast you ain't even pause you're not even letting niggas pause you're not even letting niggas, I'm gonna take a shot because I gotta say it you're not even letting nobody like digest the album that you putting out you'll put out an album right now and then niggas getting to know these songs and yeah pussy nigga I'm dropping tonight now you dropping another one you like goddamn. You can't even catch on the slide. You gotta go listen to the new one, it's and you court. missed a few songs it's that probably because you know you hear a song once or twice. I'm talking. Stop yeah. calling over me. Just wait till I finish, bro. You going crazy? <laughs> yeah, YB. Like you know the nigga put out. He'll put out. You nigga made me forget what I was about to say. Go for that nigga. Go for that nigga. He's gonna take a shot. I'm gonna take a shot. But yeah, like I was saying, he put out an album and like you know when you hear a song one time, mm-hmm. he's about to drop another If you hear a song one time, you can't really I mean some songs you can hear one time but oh this shit fire. But sometimes you gotta hear a song three, four, five times so you be like, nah, this shit is really fire. Mm-hmm. Like sometimes it take a few listens to really like like a song. So he put out music so fast, niggas hearing it and then next thing you know, you know, you ain't gonna listen to the same. You ain't gonna listen to the album 30 times in one day. You're gonna mm-hmm. listen to it today. Probably listen to it another two days later. Mm-hmm. And then this nigga dropping the next two, three days later. He's dropping mm-hmm. another one. So it's like you ain't really get a chance to listen, listen though. Right. On real shit. On real shit though. You don't get a chance to really listen. On um, people comments on what? Instagram and Twitter and all that, you don't sure. see why be better no more. And you know, that's what Joe was just saying. You won't see no why be better. You know, why be fans used to bum rush niggas Instagram posts. You know, when they drop an album or promoting an album and they'll go on to say, why be better? Why be better? Why be better? All right. That, that really ain't going on no more. All right. And academics spoke on that recently, too. You just don't see it. All right. For the last, what, three albums, why be sold like 38,000, 40,000, 30,000. Like, you know, he ain't selling like how he used to sell. 
And I noticed that YB, he even took a little break from the music because a lot of people were saying he dropping way too frequently, all right? He dropping way too much music. Maybe give it a break and then come back. Maybe you'll do bigger numbers. Bro, YB took a break, came back, dropped the album. See, I ain't gonna lie, I listen to full albums. Like, I'm really a music nigga. Like, when I listen to shit, I don't listen to just the songs I like. I never do that. Any album... Shut the fuck up! <laughs> any album... Any yeah, album... You yeah, you keep doing that. Yeah, that shit will be bugging. And you talking dumb loud, too. Like, you just trying to go over a nigga. Don't mind him, y'all. He's just African and dumb. <laughs> I'm just playing. Y'all. He ain't dumb, but he's just African and stupid. He ain't dumb, he's stupid. Go ahead, what you were saying, though? I was just saying, what you would say was right, he'd be dropping too frequently. For me, every time he's dropping an album, right after that, right after that, he's just saying, he hit on the button. That's it. Pause too, but yeah. The shit still did, you know, 30,000. Like, pretty much bad numbers, man, that YB used to don't hit, all right? You know, YB, we expect him to do somewhere between, you know, 80 to 100, 120K. You know, that's what we was used to hitting. Now he just 30K, 30K, 40K. So Joe had his take on it, man. He don't like him at all. He don't like the music. He just don't fuck with young boy music, all right? He said as simple as that. Ice had his little take as well. You know how he noticed the little, you know, the down slope and why being, you know, where he been at since he been in Utah and everything. So, you know, we all seeing this whole YB thing play out. Hopefully, you know, he get his mental state better. Hopefully he can get off house arrest soon. You know, maybe get to the outdoors, take some trips or something, open your mind, make some- I ain't gonna lie. I fuck with Joe Butter. <coughs> I fuck with the nigga Ice. I fuck with they, I fuck with they music, like takes and shit. He went crazy on young boy. He could have said that way different. Yeah, he could have said that way. But he was like mad disrespectful the way he said that shit. Like, he could have definitely said that in a better way. Like, yo, I ain't, gonna lie. I ain't feeling his last few shit. Not like, are we ready to talk about it? He trashed. Like, he went crazy. He could have yeah, like, came different. Like, pause. He could have... I'll take another one. He could have... Um, he could have said, like, yo... Shit ain't hit no more. <laughs> Back to say no more. But yeah, for, 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 him to, for him to go crazy, like, the way he went crazy, it's mad. You said you ready to talk about it? Yeah, this shit terrible. No, that's that. We got YB responders. We gonna keep this all in one video. You know, young boy went crazy. <laughs> young boy don't be playing with these niggas. Young boy don't be playing with these niggas. Oh boy. Look at him, boy. Jumped in the camera. <laughs> the last thing I dropped was a side at two. My album still in the top. Pussy ass nigga, don't speak on me, I don't play that shit. Don't rat on me neither, you pussy. Yeah, that's the thing, like, don't spite niggas, like, he don't bother nobody. Like, real shit. Yeah, why be don't be really fucking with nobody? Real shit. Niggas be really, like, just be picking sides, be on, on his dick. Cause he don't bother nobody, like. That's a fact. He don't be bothering nobody. My son be a Utah chiller, like, yeah, hey, you feel me? Now y'all niggas gotta make my son turn up. He about to make a fire Joe Button this. You know we gonna react to it. You know gonna do that. You know he about to make the... Damn, puss ass nigga. Don't speak on me. I don't play that shit. Don't yeah. rat on me neither, you pussy bitch. Damn, bubba. I said, what that piece about too many old niggas? Stupid, nigga. dumb bitch. Do your dick don't even get hard no more. Count ass nigga. Yeah, like, I ain't, no, ain't no sabotaging yeah. me, bitch. Puss, how you know that? <laughs> Fuck on hard no more count ass nigga. I don't know that you old stupid nigga. dumb bitch. Do your dick don't even get hard no more count ass nigga. Like ain't no ain't no sabotaging me, bitch. Fuck on with that nigga, man. Don't rat on me. I'm don't, don't rat on me, bitch. Don't rat on me. And I don't wanna argue with your bitch ass nigga. Hey, bitch, you do all them interviews. Hey, come on, great nigga mountain and talk to me, nigga. You can't bitch, if you can't do that, man, hey, nigga, bitch, nigga, bitch, man nigga. nigga, shut your fucking mouth. Sixty thousand. You want to go. Like, six times. Hey, YB, you see this, nigga. You don't want that smoking matter, nigga. Yeah, I'm him. I'm him. They don't want that joke. I might buy Madden on the on the computer so I can come down here and spit. Yeah. Six thousand. <laughs> Bitch. <laughs> That's six times in a row. That's six yeah. thousand. <laughs> Bitch, come on, my man. Ten thousand a game. Oh shit, number nine. He's still in the top ten. Oh. oh. I'm
let's go. Young boy, keep that pull on. Everywhere he go, mama, I've been moving on. Rave dig a mountain, nigga. <laughs> <laughs> Rave dig a mountain, nigga. Grave dig a mountain, nigga. Pull up, nigga. Bitch ass, nigga.